What's up guys, it's your boy Back Row Sling 301 coming at you with another video. Um this gate plans of mine. This is my son, um he don't know what he wants his name to be, but uh as soon as I find out what his name is, um I'm gonna leave his name down in the description. Cold War. Shaking my head. It seems like at it again, Cold War has ruined Warzone. Cold War has ruined COD. I mean, come on, man. That, that's being realistic. I know you got a lot of guys out there that say uh, Cold War is the... I mean, everybody that say that they like Cold War is probably getting paid by Activision and Treyarch. I haven't seen one person that says that they like this game and they, they just love it. That's not getting paid by them. You know, small streamers like me, uh, I just started streaming right around when Mortal Warfare first came out. I loved it. I loved the game. I, I didn't even know anything about skill-based matchmaking. But I got a whiff of it. Man. I've been playing since World at War. World of War was a good game. World of War was one of the best games. And when Treyarch came out with Black On One, I had so many uh, good feelings about Treyarch and the whole movement forward. But when they came out with Black Ops Three, Jesus Christ, man! What did they do, sir? What did they do? They ruined the whole damn thing. They came out with the battle pass, and he's like a dummy, he's not knowing about skill-based matchmaking and everything else like that. I bought it. I spent 120 for it. 120 for a goddamn game. I probably didn't even play for like two months. It was a piece of shit, man. Only time, I, and this is the first time that I found out about uh, pay to win. Pay to win. I was always getting lasered across the map, getting shot across the map. I was doing everything I could do right. But guess what? I didn't have them pay to win guns. No, I didn't. Because I wasn't paying for that shit. I already spent the goddamn, why don't fucking guns with you in the battle pass when I bought it? For 120 goddamn dollars, I should have got that shit. You still want a mold? What the fuck you want? Five, six hundred dollars off a game per person? You got to be crazy. And I'm telling you like this, man. The first time I noticed about skill based matchmaking, before I even heard of it, I wasn't on the internet doing all this shit and back and forth and researching. You know, I just played the game. I just played the game. That's all I did. But every time I played the game, and I'm getting killed by guys that I know that I should have killed. I'm gonna get that gun. That's all shit. Let me see what that. Oh, what, where's this one? I don't know. Nope. I gotta pay for it. I gotta buy it. And you wasn't getting that shit in the goddamn uh, 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 <coughs> supply drops. You wasn't getting that shit in the supply drop. I opened up a million supply drops. I got three of them guns. Only one of them I ever remember. That was the, the damn uh, stapler gun. And I was so happy when I got the stapler gun, but they came out with more guns that was even better. I mean, come on, man. We we need to do better, man. Black Ops 3, they had the best zombies ever. Be not taking nothing for all the other zombies. I like all the other zombies, but far as every map that Treyarch came with, with the zombies, I loved it, man. It was like I was mesmerized. I was mesmerized by the music, the sound, and everything we did in it. <clears throat> and I'm like, I look, I look at the ones now. I'm like, what the, what the hell did they do? When Zesta Bo, uh, uh, No Shame came on, just the music alone had me mesmerized and hyped to play it. Even though a lot of people uh, criticize and talk about how much you don't like uh, Zesta Bo, No Shame. It was one of like one of the babs smacked me. I didn't care about uh, what's this and what's that. And that's another thing. You got these guys out here that are so-called influencers. Yeah, yeah, you know who they are. I'm not gonna call their name out. They are influencers, and they judge the game and criticize the game of every little spec. You know, you know what I'm saying. That, now, to me, the Death Zombies was one of the best ever. Somebody still had a problem with it. I'm like, God. Damn, and you know what you got the next time Treyarch came out with a, a map? 
You got Black Ops 4. This to me. I was so hyped to play Black Ops 4 and the zombies. Um, the, the first map they came out with, I loved it, liked it. I still played that first map. But after that shit, man, I wasn't buying all that shit out. That shit, it was just stupid and repetitive. How you get a goddamn Wolfman in a Treyarch game? I don't even remember the name of the board that we was playing, the, the map that we was playing you. And the goddamn Wolf, you got to... Come on, man. We're not fucking kids. Listen to me. It's not that many times that I sit around and ran into a kid on the game. They're marketing to kids and kids not buying that shit. Because guess what? If my son, my daughter came to me and I, you know, I'm saying, like, what's going on here? Let me see this. Oh, yeah. oh, you ain't buying that dumbass shit. Man, you got to be crazy, man. You got to be crazy. Then look at the look at the drink that they got in uh, Cold War right now. The zombies. It's some fucking absolutely trash. Absolutely trash. This goddamn big ass stupid world map. Look like some shit that they had over, left over from a uh, 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 blackout. And not to mention blackout. You you copied Fortnite with the coloristic scheme and ganks and gimmicks, and the shit was some fucking trash. Slim, I ain't win one fucking match in a goddamn a blackout. You know why? Skill based matchmaking. Man, look, that shit is terrible, man. That shit is terrible. Treyarch is ruining card. The people that are uh, influenced or uh, 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 the guys, what can I say? The guys that Treyarch is paying and that's regurgitating this bullshit is the ones that's fucking this shit up. You see what I'm saying? These high wig people, you know what I'm saying? A uh, 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 million subscribers on YouTube or whatever are the people that are ruining the shit. Every single day, you complain about this, you complain about that. And it seems like only time you really complain is when there's a uh, another person that's coming out with a with a better game, with better maps, uh, better movement, better sound, better graphics. You know what, we, what you got? You got the fucking black. You got you got Cold War. And that joint is some trash, man. Every time you know, I got guys that I look at like a, a murder show, you know, and I feel bad for them. I feel bad for murder, you understand? And you know why? Because he continued to play the game because it gives him revenue, but Treyarch didn't give him a game that was fucking good. This shit is ridiculous, man. They gotta, they gotta stop the shit, man. They piggyback off uh, Modern Warfare 2019 and with the Cold War, when everybody was playing Cold War with uh, Modern Warfare 2019, I had the fun of my life. I had the time of my life. You understand what I'm saying? Then was uh, uh um Treyarch got a hold of it. Cold War came out. Switched the guns, the mechanic. Man, it, that shit is some fucking trash, man. Long story short, man. Let me tell you like this, man. Y'all need to fucking stop sucking Treyarch off in the goddamn corner in the dark room, all right? Dude. Check this some bullshit. Shit is some bullshit. Y'all keep telling these people uh, what to do, how to do, and keep praising them and playing the goddamn game and shit, and they keep on thinking they fucking winning. Yeah, I don't give a fuck what they sold. How many sold? Uh, a million, a billion. Guess what? You some fucking dummies. This shit is some goddamn trash, man. Y'all need to leave them goddamn people alone. Stop buying that tray. I get I, the last one, Cold War. You see me? I got the gameplay for. Uh, <clears throat> Modern Warfare, credit like my son, the Modern Warfare, um, when he finished finally making his name up, you understand what I'm saying? I'm put the link in the description to his name and his YouTube also where I get this game from, gameplay from, because mine uh, all of a sudden disappeared when he got on my game. But that's another story. You need to stop letting Treyarch and Activision dictate how your game is going to play. How are you going to play it? I don't want to spend sixty dollars for a game, um, sixty dollars for a goddamn uh, uh, a battle pass, and then still gotta fucking buy goddamn guns to win. I have gameplay on my channel right now. Look at it. 
You see what I'm saying? Just about every other game, I'm, I'm winning, or if I'm not uh, uh, winning, I got the highest kills and uh, the best KD. You understand what I'm saying? Don't let Treyarch dictate to you what you want to do, how you want to play your game. Because all you're going to end up is with a Black Ops 3, a Black Ops 4, and a Cold War. Some goddamn trash. To all the card cock suckers out there, stop the goddamn bullshit. You're getting paid by these people to play their game and show your game and try to tell me how good it is when it shit's not. I'm not a fucking dumbass, okay? And you know, that's all I really got to say about that, man. Just listen to me. Y'all, y'all need to support uh, Modern Warfare and and these other games that's out here. That's uh, I'm ripping a new one in Treyarch's ass. You understand? I still play Modern Warfare to this day, and every time I get on there, I don't even know nothing about skill-based matchmaking. Then I'm just getting on there, and I'm thinking I'm fuck it. I'm like, shit, they ow, he shit, he good, he good. Let me get better. You understand what I'm saying? But when you implement other things in there that just make it even harder to be a better person with uh, the pay-to-win guns that you gotta. I don't want to do that shit, man. I don't want to do that shit, man. But yeah, man, check my videos out, man. This is your boy, Back Row Slim 301. Um, all social media, Back Row Slim 301. Um, coming out with a new video soon. And also, uh, I do gameplay at least two, three times a week. You know, I, I stream with Apex. Uh, I stream with Modern Warfare 2019. I would love for y'all to check my videos out. Subscribe like and comment and uh, let me know what you think